We saw previously how to create a table of values for a story and using that table write down an equation. So for example we can imagine a gym draining its swimming pool. The pool holds 550,000 gallons and every two hours 5,000 gallons of water are drained. So if t is the number of hours that have passed, and that'll be our independent variable, and w is the thousands of gallons of water in the pool, and that'll be our dependent variable, we can create a table showing the amount of water in the pool at various times. When no hours have passed, the pool is still full with 550 gallons. And then every time two hours pass, there are five less gallons in the pool. So after two hours, there are 545 gallons. After four hours, there are 540 gallons. And after six hours, there are 535 gallons, and so on. Every time t goes up by 2, w goes down by 5. And so we get the equation w equals change in w over change in t plus the value of w when t is 0. And as we saw, this is in the slope-intercept form. Based on that, we can give interpretations to the slope and to the y-intercept. We interpret the slope as representing the rate of change. So that means in this problem, note that 5 halves is 2.5. 2.5 thousand gallons of water are drained every hour. But that's the rate of change of W with respect to T. Why is it a negative number? Because the amount of water is decreasing. The intercept can be interpreted as the starting value of the independent variable. So in the example, the intercept is 550. That's because the pool starts with 550,000 gallons of water. That is, the starting value of W is 550.